We were ambushed. There must be more of the silent ones. They'll attack our settlements, aren't they? They will. I'm ordering an evacuation. I need you to buy us time and hunt down those landers. Aline, inform Barker that whatever we're fighting, it's not the silent ones. Sarok, how can you be so sure? Sir, I've taken a prisoner. It's unlike anything we've encountered before. Bring it to Central. The Council can decide what it There's is. There's no time. While our forces are evacuating the population, this enemy is draining the catalyst field. Sir, we have received reports of attacks on the main terminal. We need to change our tactics. It's a catalyst they want. Stand by for orders. Whatever you are, you will not destroy our future. Sir. No communication from Barker? None. Enemy units up ahead. Directly between us and field command. Can we go round them? No. We must go through them. Farouk, come in. Sir, it's good to hear your voice. Are you hurt? I'm fine. My battle group survived the onslaught. We're preparing for a counter-assault. Hold your position. I'm coming with reinforcements. Sir, this enemy is growing fast. I must attack now. Understood. We'll be there as soon as we can. May the author favor your deeds. Is this the invader we've been fighting? One of them. Battle groups are on their way to secure the catalyst fields. I'm moving two more to secure the Suma for evacuation. These are not the silent ones. We can defeat these forces. We can't afford to be wrong here, Saruk. 
Our people must continue. Continue what? Running? Until we find somewhere else to die? I see war has given you a voice. For generations, we've run from the Silent Ones. Today we stop. Today, we teach our enemies to run from us. Lucy, any contact from Specialist Redgrave? Not since he shuttled the specimens to the Darwin. I hope he's okay. Valiant's Godel and Riemann reported coordinated assaults by an intelligent life form before they were lost. We must consider the possibility that Specialist Redgrave... I know. I know. Singleton, I'm recalling the remaining surface teams to the ship. I want you back ASAP. We can search for Redgrave once everyone else is accounted for. Yes, ma'am. I've summoned the Harvesters and I'll lift off as soon as they return. Good. See you soon. Mum, has the lab analyzed the specimens retrieved from the surface? Initial analysis suggests the presence of two separate intelligent life forms on the planet. Two? Are they both hostile? Analysis is not conclusive at this time. Any theories on why the Pathfinder program failed to detect these life forms? No theories, ma'am. You don't seem to know much of anything today, do you? Ma'am? What's the communication time to Earth? Mum? System failure in the quarantine module. A specimen from the surface is disrupting the... Mum, what's happening? Structural failure in modules 2, 7, and 9. Life support compromised. Projected structural failure in 22 this seconds. This is Mission Commander Lucy Tack. All personnel abandon ship. I repeat, all personnel abandon ship. Command Lander Module Evac initiated. Power safety systems critical. Recommend immediate evac. and display all hostile forces. Data indicates one alien and one human in origin. A human? The entity that attacked us here and on the ship matches the profile of the von Neumann probe from the Pathfinder program. You mean the goo? I thought that was decommissioned over a century ago. Lucy, a distress signal is coming from Valiant Singleton's lander. Contact the other landers. Warn them about the goo. And tell Singleton we're on the way. I was there when the Pathfinder program was abandoned. It was a tool which should have powered down and deteriorated. None of us thought the goo would remain active, much less evolve from a benign exploration device into an intelligent killing machine. Well... Maybe it had help from our alien friends. Specialist Redgrave's survival beacon has activated. Redgrave's alive? Unconfirmed. The signal is weak, but it's nearby. Mum, take us to Redgrave's location and see what you can find on the goo. We need to know how it got here and why it's changed. They've taken heavy losses fighting the goo. So they're not controlling it? Are you certain? I've seen no nanotech or AI. They still use bullets in their guns. Data suggests the goo is directing itself. It appears to have modified its own instructions when the Pathfinder program was halted following the armistice. So we left this nano explorer out in deep space and now it's evolved into a war machine. Singleton, how's it coming? Almost ready. Let him go. I am not losing any more crew. At Duerio, 
Dulral kirat hasquim sa. Yusin saubira oeska. Sur kirat kopia niogu. Diliri facha hege. Yuda falski imdus meno. What's he saying? I've told him we mean him no harm, but he doesn't believe me. He thinks we're responsible for the goo attacks on his people. We kind of are. Tell him. We'll release him. If he agrees to help us destroy the goo. Fakara Siri. Tifima Onjai Kans Tatam Fafagu. Inisru Faguyu Tilmil du Bedoremo. He says the remaining goo masses have taken refuge in that structure. Which is where the Beta's largest supply of catalyst is kept. Good. Now all we have to do is blow the catalyst in the structure to vaporize what's left of the goo. Destroying the Beta's catalyst will be a major setback for Saruk's people. I don't see that we have a choice. For us or them. Saruk? For the plan to work, the detonation mechanism must be set from inside the structure. And he is offering to go? No. I am. If you move our main forces here, the goo will have to respond. That will distract them long enough for me to enter the installation and activate the mechanism. I don't like this, Singleton. I've been through a lot worse, Lucy, and I've always come back. So that others may live. So that we may live. Mum, patch me through to Singleton. We've destroyed the goo in our area. What remains is amassing at the terminal. What's your status? I'm in the terminal core, preparing to detonate the catalyst. Okay. Hold your position. We'll regroup and launch another assault to give you... Singleton? Do you read me? Catalyst detonation has been initiated. Singleton. Detect no indications of goo. Get me confirmation. Contact all units and begin a sweep of the area. I want every last drop of goo destroyed. offering to go no I am so that others may live how many people have you killed over the years 407 the Newman probe or as the press loves to call it the goo this is valiant work reporting key personnel secure continuing rounds you a good man singleton I owe you mate Restore mass. Evaluating options. Identifying highest concentrations of catalyst. They are following a search and destroy pattern, and they know we require catalyst. If we are to survive, we need more information. Revised goal. Acquire data. Evaluating options. To send men from the Earth to the Moon took us three days. To send a rover to Mars took us over eight months. To send a probe to our closest star would take 25,000 years. In a galaxy of 200 billion stars, we were alone, stranded in darkness. One day, we discovered a hole in space. 
A very, very small hole. Not a door to walk through, but merely a keyhole to look through. So we looked. We were able to see across the galaxy, millions of years away. Where we couldn't go, we sent our most elegant creation. An algorithm of matter. A von Neumann probe. A pathfinder. A single drop of goo was man's key to unlocking the heavens. Our pathfinder, it drew us a map of the stars, revealing countless paths to other worlds. We expanded across the galaxy, fighting over every discovery. In the end, we heard no new voices. No songs, no poems, no stories. Only silence. Our quest had led us to nothing but war and loss. It had to stop. We disarmed our drones, grounded our dreadnoughts, recalled our soldiers, and extinguished the flames of our foolish curiosity. Returning home, we established a permanent armistice to preserve the one voice this galaxy has. Ours. the true monster. Standing together against the shroud that descends on our galaxy. All else be silenced forever. 